National Peanut Brittle Day. There's a day for peanut brittle and I'm so excited about it. So here to help us celebrate by making her deliciously salty and sweet world famous peanut brittle is the brittle babe herself. There's nothing brittle about you. She couldn't be more sweet. Courtney <laughs> Ray Goodson you. is here. Welcome. Welcome Courtney Ray. I'm so excited to have you. Brittle queen. Now, as you can see, Cameron, Kim, yep. Shirley, yes. and Orly We're have already so started nice. getting into yes. this peanut Let's, brittle. Yeah. And this is a real science, making the peanut brittle, it correct? Mm -hmm. Many people study it. Yeah, so we start, and many people study the eating of I it as well. I just have my Uncle Ray's recipe. <laughs> <laughs> so it starts with some sugar and... Corn syrup and water. Okay. And so you put, put that in a pot, you bring it to a boil, and then it should get to around right at 260 degrees. It takes about six minutes. Okay. And you can always test it to make sure it's ready for the peanuts to go in by taking a little bit of it and drizzling it in a cup of water and it should have a nice hot glue texture. It'll make like a thread. And is it important to have a thermometer? I would definitely say have one, that way you don't burn it and you know what to do when. Okay, so yeah. it's not, it's it's easier to not mess it up this yeah. way. Is my crunching too loud? I know, it went, no, no, it's like it's too loud. I just it's don't want to distract thing. you, can you hear it? No. I'm no. very <laughs> self-conscious about my crunching. I mean, I can hardly <laughs> hear Courtney <laughs> over your crunching. It was I like, can't keep it down. down. <laughs> <laughs> sorry to interrupt, I'm sorry to interrupt. Push the thing. After we get this to mm -hmm. this bubbling stage, mm -hmm. then it's time to add the peanuts? Yes, it is, and so I use raw blanched peanuts. Which is not, they usually use Spanish peanuts, correct? That's correct, so these bring out a more nutty, buttery, flavor which is great with the peanut butter brittle that it's gonna going to be. Oh my gosh, it's so nice. Mm. Wow. And how long do you cook the peanuts for? Sure, so once you add the peanuts in, you cook it for about five minutes. It'll get up to around 290 degrees. You wanna make sure to be constantly stirring because this will get lava hot. Wow. Oh, um, right. So be careful. Um, and we're actually already at about 290. Yeah, look at it going. Do you want me to turn it down? Let's that? actually turn it up to Oh, turn it up. Wow. Okay. We needed to get to that 300 degrees, that this hard This is crack. A, a, probably a very weird question. Mm -hmm. Do peanuts, like, cook? They're a legume. Yeah, so these are raw, and so mm -hmm. you need to cook them. So like they, yeah. okay. So like there's a like process. Did they change in oh. some way? That was a really weird question. Yeah. It was, wasn't it? As I was thinking it, I was like, why am I committing to saying it out loud? There's no. Such I should thing. just wonder in my own. Just, just got really quiet, and yeah. awkward, and I thought it would get more awkward. Exactly. Just, Sorry. just like teachers say, there's no such thing as, as a, a dumb question, question Thanks, or a bad question Debbie. or a weird yeah. question. <laughs> So now, yeah, we are ready for the vanilla. So that's vanilla extract. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and take this thermometer out. Just okay, I'll take it out of the you. way. Okay, Thank be careful. you. That is hot. Man. And then we add some sugar and some butter. Actually, it's oh. salt and butter. Oh, that's salt. That's salt. Yeah, we already oh, put the sugar good. in. Wow. The salt, the butter. Salt in there. And wow. you can't get these wrong if they're out of order. It's fine. You just keep okay. it until it melts. They just kind of go in towards the end. And you really have to stir here. You're gonna get one gorilla arm, whichever one you're stirring <laughs> oh, wow. it with. It's so gonna be a workout. Actually, yeah. Okay. It's gonna be my next workout. So. <laughs> <laughs> and this baking soda? Yes, that one goes in at the end. We want to make sure the butter's melted. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. It almost reminds me of making uh, you know, the crispy treats oh, with yeah. the marshmallows. Yeah, yeah it's all like that. that. Right? Yeah. Let's oh, go ahead and so turn fun. off the fire and then add that in. Okay, and this is going to make it like a volcano, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not so too exciting. much, yeah. It changes the color and makes it a little more airy. Wow. Oh, a nice yeah. color. You want to mix all that in? Just think about what's in there, too. Yeah. Just <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh, this is why I scream yeah. critical point when I'm cooking in the commercial kitchen with my mom. Okay. Because she knows to get out of the way and stop oh, talking. Oh, wait a minute. What about the peanut butter? Oh, 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 we forgot. Ah! Save the sorry, I'm so yeah. used to making it. It's because it. of Cameron's oh crunching. Well, yeah, you guys, you guys. I'm one so to sorry. Okay, so now it's okay. So we just take the peanut butter. It needs to be warm. Wow. We drizzle it in. Why does it need to be warm before you put it in there? Sure, because if you don't, and if it's just room temperature, you'll probably burn the brittle by the time you get it all stirred. Oh, yeah. And look how quickly oh, this done comes that. together. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay that's Especially, okay. Could you use, could you use um, chunky peanut butter, or does it have to be the sure. creamy kind? I just use smooth, just that way it warms up easily. Um, but you can use whatever you wanted, because it goes oh, well with the nuts. Okay, now critical point. Now we're ready. Now, would it just now be brittle if we did point. forget the peanut yeah. butter? Or would just, uh, no. yeah. so now, it would okay. be just peanut brittle. We pour this, this out. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Wow. look at that. Yeah. Yeah. On uh, a cookie sheet. While you're pouring that out and you're spreading it around, I love the story about how uh, you took your, your Uncle Ray's uh, peanut brittle recipe. You turned it into a business. It's very inspiring. Yeah. Thank Tell you. It. Yeah, so it all kind of started whenever I actually went to the Peace Corps. And I was in the South Pacific, and my great uncle Ray would send me big boxes of brittle, and I'd go around through the village and bring little bags by people. <laughs> Isn't that sweet? Um, yeah, so sweet. it was fun. It was a fun way, sorry, to create community. 
Um, so you just kind of spread that out nicely. Okay, and I'll then, spread it for you. Thank you. And you can continue. <laughs> So uh, while I was there, I had the opportunity to work with a woman and help train her to become an office manager. She started out the cleaning lady at the local office I worked at. Um, and over the two years, I really got to know her and knew that she wanted more and just didn't have the opportunity to do that. And so whenever I came back, I used the peanut brittle to do a crowdfunding campaign to help raise money for her to start her own little business. Beautiful. Awesome. Mm -hmm. but, but in the interim, how about this for paying it yeah. forward? She did this to help raise money for the woman to start a business, mm -hmm. but and then she realized, wait a minute, I could start a business yeah. too oh, with this. Wow. So that now both great. of them have their own business. Yeah. Isn't that, that is the most awesome. beautiful That's thing? Cool. Yeah. I just love it. Yeah. Yeah. It's it. very sweet. Yeah. So yeah. then we let this cool a little bit, and then you put the, the melted chocolate on yeah, top. Yeah, you just melt. I just have dark chocolate chips, and then you just drizzle it on top. I'd wait for it, wow. definitely the brittle to dry before eating. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, I, I burned myself a little bit. You definitely want to wait for the brittle. And then we let this cool just mm -hmm. on the counter, right? Yeah, room temperature, you don't put it in the fridge. Wolf, wow, how long does it take to cool before you can it? The brittle will be dry in an hour, but the chocolate could take longer, okay. a few hours. Okay. And then here you are, and all we it's do is break. It. Yeah. It's worth yeah. waiting. Yeah, yeah Courtney. <laughs> it's worth the wait. You know what else is worth it is the breaking part. How do you... It's so fun. Isn't it? Yeah, yes. Easy. Normally I have like a kitchen hammer that I use that gets the job done. Oh, I thought that's what um, you were going to do. What are you going to do? You're just going to drop it? Yep. I'm not gonna drop it on the ground. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah. No, you just crack oh, it just like, like that. that. Yeah. Oh. I could punch it. Uh, <laughs> it might well, actually. I would work. take it. Uh, it's absolutely yeah. delicious. Yes, yes, yes. You'll never have yes. any other peanut brittle again, everybody. Uh, God, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. For more <laughs> delicious 40. peanut brittle from Courtney, visit Uncle Ray's Peanut Brittle.com. And of course, the full recipe, as always, will be at HallmarkChannel.com.